Hi everybody, I'm News 6 meteorologist Candace Campos. Happy last day of 2019 and what a beautiful way to end the year. All thanks to this cold front that is making its way through the eastern seaboard, brought a lot of rain, snow, sleet to the northeast. Everything is drying out. That tail end of the front still making its way through central Florida and into south Florida this morning. Cool air, cold air I should say, will continue to rush down the state. You can see the modeling forecast showing nice dry conditions, so strong northerly breeze will continue to drag that cold air uh, across central Florida today. Highs are going to be staying in the 60s today with overnight lows tonight as we ring the new year into the 40s. So here's your day planner for the, again, the last day of the year. Temperatures are going to be staying between about 68 and 69 degrees. The sunshine will return. It will be feeling very nice and comfortable. Yesterday it was still very muggy and humid. Not the case today. So if you are planning on enjoying the day outside, you should because the weather's looking great. Uh, if you're planning on spending the day out of the theme parks, you will certainly have some company as we are expecting some of the parks to close because of capacity uh, pretty early today. But look how nice the weather is looking throughout most of the day. Temperatures will be in the mid to upper 60s throughout the afternoon. But it's going to be the big story is later on tonight with overnight lows down into the 40s. So as we take you here hour by hour, so you can plan out your day, 69 degrees will be our high, which is running a few degrees below average. But look at that, the fireworks over Orlando tonight, 49 degrees will be our overnight low. It will be cold and clear with a light wind from the north. But if you don't live in Orlando, other spots, you're going to be feeling even colder depending on where you are. 42 will be our wake-up temperature in Ocala. We're about 48 degrees in Sanford early tomorrow morning. Some areas might stay in the 50s, like Cocoa Beach, Melbourne. You might stay in the mid to low 50s, but certainly cold by your standards. And as we roll out the next seven days, as we say hello to 2020, the new decade, another very nice day. Temperatures once again in the 60s. We'll hop right over the 70s go right into the 80s by Thursday and Friday. Another front expected to arrive by Friday and into Saturday, and you can see a nice little cooling trend awaits us once again for the weekend. I hope everyone has a happy and safe New Year's. We'll see you tomorrow.